more context, I have been under a great deal of pressure for months and months now to tone down my Israel coverage at Rising. Um, it started, I think, really in earnest about uh, six months ago or so when there was a radical shift in uh, the uh, staff at the Hill where basically every single person who worked there was either fired or um, pushed out. Uh, the, the work environment was so difficult that they chose to leave basically um, and as new staff replaced them particularly new producers uh, who exerted much more editorial control over the content than had ever been exerted before they particularly put a lot of scrutiny on coverage of Israel and started to refer to our coverage uh, as an Israel block so we do about you know eight to twelve blocks uh, segments a day and they started to refer to this idea of an Israel block where we could only do one segment on Israel. And as you can imagine, Glenn, given the plethora of stories that come out on a daily basis, some of them are domestic politics issues, some of them are straight news reporting about whatever bombing campaign most recently happened in, let's say, Rafa. Some of them are about uh, the choice to have Netanyahu come to speak to Congress. You might have a story about um, what happened on a college campus protest. You might have a story on and on and on. You could easily do 12 segments on Israel every day. 